Aloha, brothers and sisters, come this way. So, nine months ago, Pam and I bought a condo in Kona, Hawaii during a pandemic. And uh, we weren't allowed on the island to look at it. So we bought it sight unseen and prayed it would be okay. And this is what we got. So come on in. This is it. Let me shut the door here. And when we first got it, this was, uh, this was a wall. It went all the way to the ceiling and it pretty much blocked the rest of the condo. So Pam and I just chopped it off, took the whole wall out, threw it away. So that was the first thing we did. Then the next thing was all the furniture that was in here was just, it was so horrible. So we got rid of all the furniture and then had to go buy all new furniture and trying to find furniture on an island in the middle of the Pacific Ocean during COVID is quite the task, let me tell you. But we pulled it off. This is the kitchen. We got all new appliances. We got coffee makers that make coffee before you awake, because that's important. <laughs> I gotta have coffee in me to make coffee. And we've got uh, the guest room here. And we've got over here, we've got the bathroom, guest bathroom, and stackable washer dryer. And then we have the surfboard. This was uh, Bruce and myself made this. Uh, Bruce and I made this before Bruce died in November. So this has a lot of sentimental uh, value. Uh, Mason surfboard. We never got to ride it, but we did shape and glass it and um, came out really good. And uh, I miss my friend. And then uh, also when we moved in here and oh, first off, that's my mom right there. My mom loved Hawaii. We sent her a car over here too, so that we'd have a car here and she can look down and be happy seeing it. Um, when we first got here, we had a TV about this big and um, it was haunted. So it um, would turn on in the middle of the night. It would change channels by itself in the middle of the night. I'd unplug it and it would turn on again. I mean, spooky shit. So we got rid of that. We got this thing and uh, this thing pulls away. So you can tilt it different ways, depending where you want to watch from. There you go. Got this beautiful dining table. Yeah, with these chairs and this carved wood. And we got these matching bar stools. Do you know how hard it is to find six matching bar stools on an island in the Pacific Ocean during a pandemic? It's not easy, let me tell you, but we did it. So come on back here. We've got our guitar. Got a couch, coffee table, lamps, it's all tile flooring. And this is the master bedroom in here. It's a little messy because we're actually living here right now. And that's the master bathroom in there. Let's take a quick look at that. So there you go. And come out here, I'll show you the best part of the whole condo. Why we bought it. This is the reason, right here. Open this up. Got a beautiful table. Again, three matching bar stools on an island in the middle of Pacific during COVID. We were able to locate matching bar stools. Loungers, got my surfboards here. We got an incredible view. You can hear the ocean crashing all night. It puts me to sleep, it's so awesome. That ends the tour of Konabari Kai, condo number 406. Shaka and Mahalo. Ra.